Hello, Commanders. Welcome to another episode of Surviving Mars. And in this particular episode, we are going to consolidate the domes as prefaced in previous video. So you can see us taking advantage of the Blow and Beyond DLC. We are underneath the surface of Mars, so checking on some things, seeing what we need to do. So here I'm um, looking at all the colonists that we have. There's definitely quite a bit. I, I want to group all the scientists in, a in an area where they can conduct research. There's actually a part of the map that has a plus 10 research uh, I guess perk. So we're gonna put them in a dome over there. I think it's a regular size dome. And then, so to actually remove a dome, I found out if you're having trouble uh, deleting or recycling a dome, you actually have to empty out every single thing inside of it. And then you can unlock the option to dismantle it. You probably did not realize how to do it. Um, it took me a while to figure it out. I, I did look up in a form how to do it, but there was like no answer. There's like, all it said was, uh, it was actually from the Paradox forms. There is no way to delete the domes. They're, uh, they're permanent. <laughs> so I was like, that can't be right. I hope they uh, fixed it in an update. Sure enough, I just followed my gut, emptied uh, whatever was in the dome, and I saw that the uh, this mantle thing was uh, available. And our actual the actual people that contribute to the forms that say, "Hey, I, I did this, and this actually worked." So I'm one of those kind of people that uh, even if I am. Even if something is known or something is uh, a proven thing, I will still try my own thing because I figured, hey, there's there's probably something that's not fully uh, realized here uh, based on what makes sense right? in my mind that uh, it would be too easy to, to overlook or overshadow. So my recommendation is if you ever find your yourself in a place where uh, you don't know uh, what to decide or what what to follow uh, i'd say follow your gut uh, follow what you believe logically in your mind what, what makes sense because you know discoveries are meant to be discovered right new things are bound to be created uh, you, you don't need to rely on other people to tell you what's right or wrong right it can be guidelines, right? Don't get me wrong, but don't um, don't consider them as a end-all, be-all thing. You know, decide for yourself based on your knowledge and your experience. You'll you'll actually feel better about it because it's your thing that you discovered. Right? Anyway, I won't go into that. The whole premise of this thing. We're trying to consolidate into a dome. I don't believe I finished it this episode, but I definitely start doing it. We just removed one of the domes, but there's definitely a lot more that we need to uh, consolidate. The, the one that's on the top left corner, the two triangle domes, the miniature domes, they do not need to be there. They, those are the ones that where I found the, the child that wanted to live on their own and uh, there was nothing there. So I believe I removed that. Uh, I do have the the research center set up, the research dome. It's with the, uh, the perk that has a plus 10 research, the left hand side. So I, uh, I pull, pulled all the scientists and put them there. And I put the, all the geologists on the southern part of the map because I ran out of uh, rare metals in the middle of the map. So I, I figured uh, to keep them moving, I'd probably uh, do the same thing with the southern part of the map. But uh, it's a lot of things that uh, 
you need to consider when you're building on Mars. Uh, this whole consolidation project is so that everyone that needs to be where they need to be are in their place, right? In, in the place that they need to be. I, uh, since I put all the uh, geologists in one area, I made them be the ones to house the, the, the farm areas, the diners, and the, di the diners and drives in and dives. I'm just kidding. I was, that, that's what I was uh, leaning towards when I was thinking about it. But uh, the diners, the grocery stores, and the hospitals are all housed by geologists just to keep them in there. Because I set up filters so that when the Mars University graduates graduate, that they go to their the dorms, the domes that they're able to go to. So I, I set up filters for each dome. So the scientist domes can only um, have scientists in them. And the dome that has the, that's mining for the rare minerals can only have geologists in them. So I'm, I'm designating domes like that. If you have a, an idea of a, a better way of doing it, just let me know in the comments. Um, if you have a suggestion on this actual one pa no pa no more passenger rockets challenge, feel free to let me know. I'm also already seeing the difficulty of it as the souls go by. I notice uh, these colonists uh, only last a certain number of souls, so uh, I get like a, a rush of elderly uh, colonists. Uh, before they they pass, and so I, I can't figure out when the Martian born are born because I don't pay attention to the <laughs> the comfort level or how many uh, male to female ratio there are in the dome. But uh, if you want to check that out, all you have to do is hover on the birth uh, or the baby marker in a particular dome, and I'll show you who wants what and uh, what the comfort level is to have uh, Martian borns or babies. Anyway, this is all the time that you have, I, uh, all the time that I have, and probably all the time that you have, so I appreciate you stopping by. If you like this video, please hit the like button. If you want so that you don't miss any future videos, hit the subscribe button, ding that bell, and I'll see you in three days. This is John as I'm signing out. Take care, stay safe, and remember, you're essential. Oh, by the way, the next episode, we're gonna continue on this. I forget to preface you on the next episode. But we're gonna continue on this, and I do want to be able to head to an asteroid too. Um, I need those exotic minerals. I, I'm not sure where they come from. They're probably from underground or on an asteroid, so we'll explore that later. Take care, guys. See you in the next episode.